we really stuffed up today um, just sitting in the shade waiting for the heat to cool off so that we can get somewhere that we should have been before lunchtime. Today was meant to be an easy day. And if you're like, whoa man, she's dirty. Yes. Yes, I am. It's 8am and I am covered in sweat. <sighs> um, I mean, we're going uphill all morning and I just scrambled up an old farm trail, super steep. And um, I've got three Ks till our first break. I don't know how we're gonna manage today. If it's this hot all day. It's not even hot yet. Hopefully on the other side of this mountain, it's shady like it has been through the rest of the week. <sighs> Going up another secret passage. There's one bat. Great day to test out these shoes, which by the way, are being rubbish still. I'm gonna soak them today and see if that softens the point that's irritating me. Nice. It's nice doing this in shoes that grip. I'm on another shortcut. <laughs> um, it's a pretty great track, actually. Um, I could definitely do it with a hiking pole, but what I also would like to know is if at the bottom of this there's a river crossing. I'm really hoping that there's a bridge. <laughs> I'm definitely, this is a one-way track, you know? Like, I'm not walking back up this, no way. And it's super hot, so I'm glad that I'm not walking up it like I was this morning and that I had to show it this morning even though I was melting. attention because um actually have a look <laughs> yeah I have to pay attention because um there's a lot of side tracks and I definitely don't want to um go down the wrong way because it is steep and I want those bridges to be there at the bottom of this hill. Times like this, I'm really, really grateful for my GPS working quite accurately. This is my trail, my shortcut. Well, it's not a shortcut really. Actually, it would have been faster on the road, but it's so hot, I didn't want Wombat walking on the road. And it's usually fun for him, more fun for him, to walk off lead. So here we are. I had to cut through a yard, um, like a private property and go over to cut over some barbed wire fence <laughs> to find a very unused trail. But actually it's still here. There was a few moments where I was like, uh oh, <laughs> I don't want to walk back up that hill, but we're onto something. But one bad is anyway. I should have been in the town that I wanted to get to for a nice afternoon rest by now. And I was thinking of doing an extra five kilometers after it. But I'm still in this rainforest because the trail ended and I couldn't get out. 
and I could have gone back, probably should have. Anyway, I don't even know if um, the trail that I'm planning on taking is going to be there, let alone that bridge I was talking about. Shit. Anyway, it's 200 meters up here, but I'm just having a break first. And the good thing is I'm on a river, so worst comes to worst, I can always go back down, go to a town, <clears throat> get a motorbike to take me back up and then start again from where I started. But go the other way. Oh, that was the worst. Wombat was really stressed. And there's probably a really easy way through because someone said I could go this way. It's probably like if I'd stuck to that road where I had to cut through the property, maybe that, oh, uh, who knows? Maybe, maybe, maybe. Anyway. <laughs> okay. Got a break and we're walking and the entry to where I should have come out and the start of the trail should be here somewhere, really close. I'm hoping to see like a, a low point on the bank. Or that. Maybe that. We're in a coffee farm, following an easy enough space between the coffee plants. Hopefully we'll be back on track, even though we are so, so late. <laughs> and if you're like, whoa, man, she's dirty. Yes. Yes, I am. And I had a hot, hot, long shower last night and it was all undone today. <laughs> I actually did try and wash off in a river. I mean, it was shallow where I was. Um... Uh, and I'm glad I did because I just I was full of mud and sticks and leaves and everything. Um, but here's hoping that I have another decent shower tonight. Otherwise, I'm just going to bear the hot one. <laughs> bear the cold one. <laughs> hey. Anyway, we found the path. It's a nightmare. I'm not even all the way up it yet because it just got too hot. And we've been sitting here under a tree. And for a while under an umbrella because this tree is not one of those full covered ones. There he is hiding from me. Um, waiting so that we can do the last seven and a half K. Which I'm going to do in about five minutes we'll go. And we should get in there by five. And if he's too tired still, well, we can wait another hour and just get in late and maybe take tomorrow off. Because, you know, when you have a shit day... It should be good to yourself. It's like you've earned it. <laughs> Luxuries. I just asked him if he wants to keep walking and he put his paw on me. I think he wants an extra 10 minutes. <laughs> so I'm obliging. It's downhill the whole way. To Betulia, which is the name of the town that I'm aiming for. Yes! Behind me is the town that I was aiming to be at by 11 a.m., and it's now almost 5. I might even stay there two nights because I think I've earned it, but it just depends on how that town is vibing. Wombat's well, definitely over it. <laughs> I've got him on the lead because he's not paying enough attention. And he is not happy about it. <laughs> ah, not just on the bed, but on the pillows. Um, so I found a hotel, the first one, there was a seedy old man and it was quite disgusting. Um, I just didn't want to stay and have a day off in that kind of place so I decided to try a different hotel and I'm here and they're gonna clean my clothes for me because they're completely full of dirt and I was like is there a lavenderia in this town like a laundry 
and um, the girls looked at each other and they had a quiet talk and they're like, do you have much? And I'm like, just what I'm wearing. And so they're gonna wash it for me. So good. So I'm gonna have a shower now and get rid of all of this grit and muck and start tomorrow fresh, have a day off, and then do my 40K massive day the next day. Clean and not angry or in a bad mood or feeling like I wanna quit. Well, I'm nearly at the top of my ascent this morning after taking a day off and I have to say totally worth it because my shirt is cleaner than it's been since I got here probably ever <laughs> and um, walking up this hill was a total delight this morning I really have enjoyed it even though it's been seven kilometers of straight up but comfortable and um, I'm feeling heaps better and I don't have to deal with muddy socks and clothes and being uncomfortable generally so that was the right choice. We made it to the top of the hill. And the other thing that I didn't mention is that um, I got a bit severe with my shoe over the day off. <laughs> and it hasn't hurt once today, so things are looking up. See you out there. <laughs>